Hi everybody, Josiah here, also known as Chilling Silence, and yesterday was a fantastic day for Digibuy. We upgraded the network to now work with the AutoCrypt algorithm. Absolutely fantastic to see it is live on the main net and working fantastically. Uh, so what I'm going to do is cover over a couple of quick uh, news updates. Uh, there's a bunch of them, so we're going to churn through them rather quickly. So the first was obviously here. Uh, we can see AutoCrypt is now active, the newest mining algorithm uh, in blockchain has successfully arrived with Digibyte. The first auto block was mined exactly on uh, 9,112,320 and we can see that here inside of the block explorer. So it says over here the algo is auto. Uh, again if you were watching the live stream that I had with Jared and also Noah jumped in uh, that was great it was a lot of fun. Uh, what you can do is you can go to the Digi Explorer and have a look and it will show you all of the different blocks that are being mined with the individual algorithms. Um, so also we've got uh, a bit of an update as well. The, the only thing that didn't go smoothly was the Android and iOS apps. There is an update that we need to push out for those. Very unfortunate, don't worry. All of your funds that are on there are still completely safe. They can't up and disappear or anything along those lines. So there's no need to worry. If you do need it in a hurry, you can use DigiSweep and I will put some links in the description below, both to this article, which explains it, uh, that we wrote yesterday before the upgrade, uh, and also if you need to do any fund recovery. Uh, we also have what to mine a very popular mining algorithm. Uh, what, do we, what would you call it? Uh, profit calculator. Uh, has already upgraded and is exp uh, and, and is, sorry is showing the mining rewards difficulty and hash rate for the autocrypt algorithm. It's super awesome to see. Uh, down here we're currently just under two tera hashes per second. Uh, so that's a, a lot of miners already mining autocrypt, which is great to see. Uh, one of the interesting things that I noticed as well was after the change and after we removed Myriad Grostel. Uh, Verge, who actually also still use that, they saw a bit of a, a really decent spike uh, in their hash rate on that. So this has also been good for them, which is kind of cool as well. Um, we've had a tweet here as well from Coin Foundry. Um, so they've also gone and started up an AutoCrypt mining pool, which is great to see more support coming in from a bunch of different places, both in terms of AutoCrypt hardware vendors, uh, pools, and general support around the entire ecosystem as well. It's been really good to see. Uh, finally, I've uh, got a message as well this morning from Murat. Uh, he has a DigiID, uh, what would you call these? These are like buttons, I suppose, and widgets that you can put onto your website. Uh, I'll include the links to these as well down below. Uh, he runs the digibytewallets.com website, which is a fantastic website, which you can go to have a look at different uh, wallets and different options that people have for storing their Digibyte. So a really quick update today, again yesterday went really really well uh, for the most part aside from the Android and iOS apps. An update is coming out very shortly, now the silver lining is, this means that you're going to be getting the Digi Assets on Android a whole lot faster. Now iOS users have obviously just had a rather big update themselves which includes Dandelion support. So Android users will be getting this Dandelion support and Digi Assets probably within the next day or two. So stay tuned, we're going to have a lot more information, uh, you should follow uh, at Digibyte Coin on Twitter. Uh, you can stay tuned in Telegram uh, or on Blockfolio Signal. We'll keep you all updated and the likes. If you do have any questions, feel free to sing out in the comment section below here on YouTube. Alternatively, you can tweet me. I'm at DGB underscore chilling. Otherwise, I'll talk to you in the next video. We'll see you tomorrow. Cheers.